Rock took on the name Moses. They saw him as their leader and spiritual father, just like the biblical character. Many of the women in the commune complained that they were lonely and had not been married yet. Once, one of the women even confessed to Giselle that she slept with Rock while everyone else was working on the cabin. Giselle was so upset she tried to run away, but Rock caught her, and when he did, he really let her have it. He tackled her to the ground and wrapped his hands around her throat, and he choked her until she feared for her life. And when he let go, she promised to return to the cabin and stay there. After this, he claimed that all the previous marriages in the commune were void except for his own, and then he began marrying all the women to himself. Now that Giselle feared for her life, he could get away with whatever he wanted, and he could have all the women to himself. After marrying each woman, he often had sex with them to consummate the marriage. Only one of the women didn't want to marry him, and this was Maurice, the outsider of the group. All the other women loved Rock, but Maurice kept her distance. She was only there because her husband Gigar believed Rock was the messenger of God. 